Hey guys, and welcome to another stream with me, Supernautus. And tonight we're back with uh, more Beneath the Steel Sky. And we're here. Uh, last time we had a problem because we seemed to miss pieces of conversation uh, that allowed us to progress the game. I had a quick look just to work out why that was. And I've worked it out now, which was that I'd missed... Well, I'd missed some conversation. Uh, so... Oh, uh, what we need to do is we need to go back up here. We need to speak to Anita again. In the factory. Come on, Joey. Because we've missed some subjects that she uh, needed to talk to us about. Which is a little frustrating, but we know what we're doing now. So it's all good. Come on, you can move now. Let that, where is he going? Let that guy, oh yeah, he's stuck. He can't actually go down there anymore. I remember now, He's a... he actually can't get home. Which is hilarious, let's be honest. Mr. Lamb. <coughs> But we can, I hope, go and speak to Anita over here now. It'd be quite frustrating if it turns out that we can't. Yeah, I was worried he was gonna tell us that we couldn't go there like he did that one time. Okay, let's speak to her about some other stuff. How come you were made a D-Link? How come you were made a D-Link? I was caught hacking into Link. Why hacking? Did you do that? There are areas in Link space used by security. I was trying to discover what they're up to. Uh, what do you mean what by link space? space? The word inside the computer's memory. The abstract projection of linked circuits and data banks. Will the jammer get me into link Will space? Will the jammer get me into link space? No, the only access is through the special interface. Special so interface? You'll need to get a Schreiberman port. Schreiberman port. How do I get a so what we should do port? is we should well, you'll have to uh, exhaust a every I need that, like I need a hole avenue in my head. of conversation. The Schreiberman port is a hole in the head. Which we didn't do. Does Link have internal Link security? Have internal security? <laughs> well, Excuse me, sorry, just a little cough. What are they? Which I'm just going to try and resolve. Program. Are they dangerous? Well, the little lozenge. The I hope terrorist. you don't hear me. But some high -level foil having the whole time. <laughs> Now, what do you know about the council? What do you know about the council? It was one of the council who came up with the plan to bond his mind with Link, and has since then things have been getting moved. And I'll keep an eye on the uh, conversation there too. But yeah, so see you, see you later. Uh, now we should be able to go back down to that doctor's surgery. 
Uh, if we go down to that doctor's surgery, then we should be able to s ask a few more questions of his secretary. So yeah, we need to have a conversation with the uh, holographic secretary that we were chatting to yes uh, the last time. That was a couple of days ago, it wasn't yesterday. Because <laughs> yesterday we of course played uh, Just Cause 4. Uh, hopefully we'll be back with some more of that tomorrow. But for now, we're off. We need to find a way into Link Space. And Joey's not with us. That's concerning. We didn't wait for him, that's the trouble. Oh, that's that weird guy. Who we don't need to talk to. The only thing is, I'm not sure... Like, if I go in here... And talk to the secretary, there's a part where I'm supposed to get... Um... My robot. I want a Shriegman port. Oh, there we go. That's a new, Your name, please? new Robert conversation Foster. option. There's little chance of seeing the doctor. Really? Why's Why that? Not? I have instructions not to disturb him, unless you wish to pay cash, of course. Wait, what? But 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 I'm not finished. Can anyone else supply yeah, the port? Yeah, not finished. Oh no! Don't just keep the going away. Is unique to Doctor Park. Right, and I want him to do it, so. Don't keep going away. I'm okay. just look. Please take one. I'm gonna have to go and look for Joey. I think I'm gonna have to go back up the elevator because I'm pretty sure that you can't actually come down unless he comes in the elevator with you and he wasn't on screen. So there's some little elements to this game which were which were a little frustrating. Uh, mainly that I have to go back up to make sure that he gets in the elevator. He'll probably be waiting for us when we get to the top. That's a little bit frustrating. Where does he see? He's not caught up with us yet. There he is. We'll let him get here, and then we'll be able to go in the elevator again. Come on, Joey. See? There we go. He's just a little too slow, so when you do things like this to get down into other areas, make sure that Joey's with you. Otherwise you have some trouble. Now Joey should be able to talk to the holographic secretary. Basically she won't let us in. But... Our friend Joey here might be able to do something about that for us. So we'll just wait for him. Because he needs to be in the room before we can continue. Yeah, we've got some posters there with uh, various body parts. Including some very pixelated breasts. Yeah, I, I know. It's interesting actually, you know, because years ago when you were playing this game you probably never noticed that. Uh, right, so Joey, try talking, try to, that talking hologram. to that hologram. Joey. What for? I need to see the doctor. Yeah. And she won't let me in. What shall I say to her? I don't know, uh... Use your, use your natural charm. charm on her. I've got an idea. I'll try the subtle approach. What's he gonna do, like, try and delete her? That's subtle. That would be subtle, wouldn't it? Don't let us in, we'll delete you. Hey, you! Open that door! I take my orders from Dr. Burke. I take mine from Overman. Uh... Oh, why didn't you say so before? Wait, what? Good grief. And we're in. Yeah, don't ask me. Ah, here we go. So here's the doctor, and he's working on a man. Excuse me. Okay. Don't make me jump like that. Why? 
Sorry, didn't realize you were busy. Just practicing. Practicing? I like to keep my hand in. Well, as a doctor, what surely you I mean you're just you? going about your day-to-day -day work. For. Really? Do you have sufficient credit? All I've got are the clothes I'm I wearing. don't know. In that case, you require the easy pay scheme. Yes, that's yeah, it. Okay. Kidney, lung, or testicle. Yeah, what? 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 Pa pardon me? Which organ do pardon you wish me? to sell? I'm not selling anything. Oh, well, we might have no to. No parts, no port. Yeah, we Send don't really have any... Customer. Don't really have any options. Here, I'm afraid. Excuse me. Um... Okay, well, let's... Let's try and I see suppose if I could spare a he lung. wants my lung. Let's have a look at them first. Oh, okay. Stand behind the scanner, please. Is that the scanner over there, do you reckon? Oh, it goes automatically anyway, so it's fine. Hold still, please. My guess is his lungs aren't going to be much use. I can't use either of them. Why not? They're too good to sell at second hand. They're too good to I sell at second hand. Myself to be profitable. You make money by trading people's organs? Okay. What else would I do with them? Open a restaurant? Okay, listen. So you don't Excuse want my me. lungs. That's fine, you don't want my lungs because they're too good. Not mine, but his. Maybe I wouldn't mine wouldn't miss be. A kidney. Kidney? I'll have to run some Scanner points. again. On the scanner? Yes, please. Turn around, please. Sure. Are they too good as well? Has someone been experimenting on you? No, not that I'm aware of. That? I've never seen a body quite like yours before. I'm afraid I can't use them. Is there something wrong? Tell me, Doc, I can take it. I don't think it's anything bad. Too yeah. healthy. Most bodies would reject your organs. That, does that sound right? Body Excuse would reject me. organs because they're too good? So how am I going to get the Shreedman port I then? guess I've no choice, Doc. I'll have to sell you my... It's not as bad as you think. No, why's that? When I said I'd take your testes, I meant after your death. That's a great Wait, consolation. Wait, so I can... All I require from you now is a signature. Is your consent. Oh, okay, yeah. Take a seat, please. Well, that's uh, acceptable. Do you use local if you'd been a little clearer about oh, that. Oh no, it doesn't hurt. Any more than having your ears pierced. What, drilling a hole in you? In that case, I need a general anesthetic. Is he like anesthetic? putting a USB socket in him or something? Oh, that doesn't hurt. Yeah, that doesn't look like it hurts at all. You now have a Schriedman port. Awesome. You may experience headaches, but don't worry, it's quite normal. That's great. But listen, there's other questions I've got for you. Excuse me. He's, he's taking his own nitrous oxide there. Bit of laughing gas. Uh, receptionist, receptionist is strange. Receptionist certainly is strange. That's my wife you're talking about. Your wife? Oh, you're yeah. married to a hologram? Apparently so, yeah. She wasn't a hologram when we wed. Was she not? She died oh, last okay. year, but I decided to keep her. Doesn't the fact that she's dead distress you? Obviously not. No. She's a lot less trouble than when she was alive. <laughs> that makes some kind of sixth sense, I suppose. Can you get me to ground yeah, level? Yeah, can you get me to ground level? I have my reputation to consider. If you're determined, you might ask my friend Willy. Willy. Just tell him I sent you. He where, has a rather where is special he? policy. And where will I find him? He doesn't tell me. I think I, I know where he is. He's, uh, Any after effects? He's at the insurance agency. Yeah. Pain. Hmm. Impairment of vision? No. I keep seeing flying saucers. Any dizziness? Yeah, I can hardly stand. Doesn't sound you right. Know, I get exactly the same myself. 
Do you? I wish I knew what causes it. There's some not much help, are you, Doctor? Really? Or what kind Thanks of doctor you are? Thanks again for the port, Doc. It's a pleasure to do business with you. That's not what he said. See that? It says, thank you for your custom, and he said a completely different thing. I've noticed that a couple of times, actually. There's a few periods uh, in the game where uh, the character will say one thing, but the subtitle says something else entirely. Okay, so yeah, the... the um, Willie that he's talking about, he's actually the insurance agent. We went into the insurance place briefly, didn't we? Uh, so we go back and we'll speak to him again. Uh, but before we do that, there's a couple of other things we need to do. What I need to do is first of all go in here to Anchor Insurance. to wait for Joey. Where is Joey? Come on, Joey. When you're ready, hey? He does take a while to arrive. Sometimes that's a good thing. Wait, what am I talking about? So first things first, I need him to interface with, with the computer. computer. Joey? I could if I wanted to. Well, do it. Forget it. No, no. No. I need him to do that. Why? Never mind. Damn it. Use your well what for that anchor. I'm always ready for. Okay, but. What am I doing? We need an anchor. Okay, look, that didn't work, so... Never mind. Okay, um... I think I just... I might have just screwed up. I want one of your special policies. Who sent you? Uh, Burke. Dr. Burke. The ghoul, huh? He is cool. So, how can I help you? Can you get me out of the city? It's dangerous. Yeah, I guess that. Are you sure you've got the balls? At the moment, That's yeah. <laughs> Wait For here. now. I have to make a call. Sure. Right, I need you to get quick. that anchor quick. Get that anchor while he's away. And hurry before the jerk... Well, why is a jerk? Just because... Get that anchor. Oh, come on, get the anchor. Come on. Get the way, Joey. You're in the way. Oh, now you're out of the way. Well, that's just great, isn't it? Oh, yeah, we want to use that with that useful item to make a grappling hook because we might need that and then we want to go back to the factory while he uh, did what he was doing although I've not there's something I've missed doing there which I need to just double check hang on Joey come back oh bugger I need to wait for Joey to come back in because he was supposed to do that computer but he's not there. Come on, you just went out the door. Okay, no, he can't do Never anything. Mind. But we don't need to do that. What we need to do is go back up to the factory. Because uh, that guy's not really much actual use to us. Um... What we did need is this so that we could go to another building. In order to do that, well first we need to go back to the beginning area of the game. In the factory. 
need to wait for Joey though, otherwise we have to wait go back down. Hmm. Right, come on, Joey. Come on, Joey. So yeah, here we go. Back up. Uh, the quickest way for, it's, for us to get where we're going really is to go this way. And then down these stairs. Oh no, it's not. Wait a minute. No, it's not. Go in there. No, it's not. Sorry, I'm misremembering. Actually, no, it's this way. We go in that door on the right-hand side. That takes us back to the the room with the, the robot picking up the barrels. We want to go out there. I go up the stairs. Right up the stairs. So we want to go through there. And then our next step is to take this grappling hook that we just made and attach it to that sign. This could be the most stupid yeah. thing I've ever done. Probably is. Also, I'm pretty sure Joey can't follow us here. So <laughs> that's not very helpful. Okay. I guess I'll take my grappling hook back. I might need that again. Uh, from what I remember, the lockers are fairly useless, but we'll have a double check. It's locked. How about that one? It's locked. Not that one. This one? It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. I'm pretty sure there is one that opens. It's locked. But it's pretty much useless. There's not really anything in it that we can actually use. It's locked. No, I'm wrong. It's locked. I was wrong, there are none that are open. Doesn't really matter anyway, we just want to go this way. And we're in a completely different building. Just a quick save, just to make sure that we don't... Uh... Yep, save us that one. Okay, so we're in a different area. A slightly more interestingly futuristic looking thing. Uh, we have an interface. What we want to do is use our card on the interface. Uh, oh, sorry, no, there's an interface slot is where we want to use our card. Uh, so we want to use it on that slot. And then we want to climb in here. And then that should take us into Link Space. And we want this ball. This is Link Space. Link being the system that's protecting everything. Uh, if I remember rightly, we go through this door. Uh, we want, so now at the top here, slightly different, we don't have our inventory, we've got a series of commands. Um, you know, info disconnect, open, document, uh, Sharon, compress data, and document. Uh, we've got two documents, so I'm just going to turn down my headset just slightly. Um, but what we want to do is use open on this bag. Excuse me one moment. So now there's a present. And a magnifying glass. We want both of those. Both of those are a requirement. Now, the next thing we have is we have this. So this allows us to decrypt documents. Uh, so now I can look at the document. Oh. Well, not quite. 
Uh, but what we want to do is decrypt the documents. They're decrypted now. Uh, and then we want to carry on going this direction. Uh, there is actually something else we want to do. We do want to decompress the compressed data. Uh, that's now got two passwords. Uh, what we need to do uh, are essentially use the passwords. So we go this way. I believe. And then we put that down. That's no use. So I do need to put that there, because if I don't... Right, just put it there for a moment. I need to pick this one back up, because I think I've put the wrong one on the thing. So it does open a route there. So what about using the red one on here? No, it's the same. Oh wait, no. I think I've got it. Yeah, that'll let us go... No, that's not quite right, is it? Oh no, wait. Should be able to now take the red one. Yeah, that's what it is. And then use the red one on there. No, that's not right. That's not right. I feel like I've made some kind of Cardinal error. Uh, take that, put that there. Take the red one, put it there. I'm not sure about this though. Take the green one back. The passwords are a little bit of a pain of it if I remember rightly. Basically, I need to be able to... It's like I can go there. Oh, there I can get the password back. That's what it is. If I go there and then I go back, that should get me where I'm going. And I want to take that one. And then I go there. I can go up this way. It's a little bit frustrating, but basically I need to go over here. That should, I hope, allow me to place the green password there, which will get me out of the room. That's a little bit of an annoying puzzle, but that's how it works. Get the right pattern of passwords. And here we find another room with a bust and a book. We want to take both of these. <coughs> Excuse me. So we need the book and that. And at that point, there's a new document in our list there. That's Phoenix. Now, so we need to decrypt that document. It'll become useful later on, and we'll find out. So, now I have to disconnect. We've got everything we need. I disconnect. It takes me out of the terminal. And this gives me some more information to use in the security terminals. So we'll go over and use it right now. And if we go to the security services terminal, uh, we can view the documents that we just found. So we've got briefing, report, and Phoenix. Uh, so we want to look at all of these. Uh, briefing dot doc, special op operative reference U088 slash H2 Reich, uh, subject Overman R. Mother Ref VP06 
slash N9 Piero. Mar Maria, native of Hobart, removed child and bid to defect back to Hobart. Flight terminated in Gap. Reference X937. Y382. No infant remains found at crash site. Briefing dot dot continued. Searching all Gap Dweller camps in the area. Return Overman to Link at all costs. Subject has assumed the name of Foster. That would be my name. To the report. Special Operative Reference U088 slash H2 Reich. I think that's just the guy whose card I'm using. Uh, subject Reference uh, PC49Y2 Lamb. No authority on record for increased status and promotion to supervisor. Unlawful intrusion suspected. Action level 3 surveillance. That's because of what I did with Lamb, I think. Uh, number 3, Phoenix. Duck. Special operative reference, blah, blah, blah. Subject status clearance. The bearer is authorised to utilise Phoenix status override in the course of investigations. Special security services. And that means we uh, should have better access. Um, if I remember rightly, we need to activate... There we go. So for 48 hours, I've got access to all sectors. I want to exit the terminal in that case. So my real name is Robert Overman. But so there you go. Overman... Me? Is me. And what's happened to my father? Uh, so we want to use this elevator. Just a point, we no longer have Joey anymore, but you know, we'll deal with that. Seen anything of Obins? What do you want him for? And we've got to go down to ground level now. Can't you fix it yourself? I wouldn't dare. Well, let's well, talk to the guards. I haven't all day. He's probably busy. Um. Yes. I'd like a few answers. Would you? Yes. Yeah. How do I get down to ground level? Who is Overman? Who is Reich? And why was he killed? Yeah. You can get information from the link terminal. That's not necessarily very you, helpful. Anyway. I'm here to inspect the building. Am I? Yes. In the right place. That's right. Routine inspection. Yes. Heard anything about an inspection, Sam? What kind of an inspection, Norville? Am I in the right place? A I think this is... Routine inspection. Routine, oh? Huh. That's unusual. It's not convenient right now. Quit pestering me when I'm busy. Is it not convenient for you? I'm so sorry. Oh, it's Sam. Yeah. Do you have anything to say to me? I'd like to... Is this regard... I've been transferred... He's transferred out of domestics. I have this tendency... He gets emotionally involved. It's my nature, Norville. It's not about a domestic... That's a relief. It's not about domestic, and that's a relief, and that's all he's going to say. I don't think... Yeah, we're still here. We want to get to ground level. Yeah, sorry, we're in the wrong place. I don't know if this elevator is the one I need to use. I think... No, I think we need to go this way. But Joey's here. Thought we'd lost him. But good old Joey. He's still around. Which is good. Uh, right, so we need to use our card. To go here first. And there's another elevator we can go down on the next place. I think this is what we need to do. Come on, Joey. Come on, Joey. Just takes his time, though, eh? He just takes his time getting to us. Nonchalantly, you might say. Which is a little bit frustrating for a robot. Okay, so, yeah. So what we need to do is we need to use this elevator now. Which I believe takes us down to ground level. I might be wrong, we'll soon find out. Oh, there we go, we've got access to everywhere right now. So, 
We didn't take Joey with us. Oh no! Joey must have forgotten. Oh, he, he just jumped off the cells. side. Well, that's weird. Why would he have forgotten that? That's just strange. I hope his board isn't broken. Okay. Uh. It's too heavy to carry. Looks like there's nothing we can do with Joey, right? Let's talk to this guard. What's through, What's that, through door? that door? It's off limits to the likes of you. Is it? Right. I just wondered where it leads. It's the old cathedral. Oh, There's it? nothing interesting in there. Nothing interesting in fact, at all. It's empty. It's empty. Well, then why are you guarding it? Huh? Why are you guarding it? Why guard an empty cathedral? I'm not guarding it exactly. I'm just standing there, preventing me from entering. Yeah, which would, in most definitions, be guarding. Do you know the woman with the dog? Wouldn't it? Oh, yes. That's Mrs. Piermont. Oh, Mrs. Piermont. The richest woman in Union City. The richest woman. And the ugliest. Well, you know. What's the best way out of the city? I don't think he's going to tell you. There isn't a way out. See? Then the inhabitants are no better than prisoners. Hmm. That's the Quite place right. of progress. Quite right indeed. Never, Never mind, mind then, buddy. You've got nothing interesting to say to me, so let's go see if we can speak to the lady who was just here. No, she's not here. There's a gardener and a boy. I'm pretty sure we need to... Does she never come by? There's a dog. There she is. Excuse me. Let's talk to Mrs. Piermont while we can. Hello, darling. Hello. I don't believe we've met. No, we haven't. No, I'm a stranger here. I'm Mrs. Pierre. She's got a very large face. But you can call me Danielle. Okay. How do I get out of the city? Now, why would you want to do that? Because it's nothing more than There's the prison. There's nothing in the gap but sand and savages. Well, so they've told you. But that's where I live. Ooh, how ghastly for you, my dear. Exactly. What's the mutt's name? He's a dog. <laughs> he is not a He's probably mutt. like a His name pedigree is dog, you know? He probably isn't, let's be honest. He looks, he looks he like looks he's got like fleas. He's got yeah, that's, that's the... He has millions of them. But he's allergic to So he has got fleas, powder. but he's allergic to powder. Why don't you give him a good bath? Cause oh, I've tried, but he can't bear to get wet. What a shame. Just kick him in the water. Do you Overman? know someone called Overman? Why, yes, I do. He worked with my husband, Professor Piermont. Did he? You Why? don't recognize him. Are you interested in Overman? He was my father. I'm sorry, but I don't believe you. Where's that? Overman's only son died in an accident. Oh, yeah, another one. That was no accident, Mrs. Piermont. It was deliberate sabotage by security. I don't say that kind of thing out loud. Was killed, Come on. But I survived, and I've read a document. If there's anything I know about uh, dystopian societies like this, you don't want to be telling that kind Your of story. Your was a great friend to me. Was she? If there's any way I can help you, just ask. Sure. For now, though. Never mind. I don't need your assistance. I'm gonna exit from here. Uh, and we also want to go, if I remember rightly, this way. We don't need to talk to those two just now. We do need to go this way, though. To this little shack. Won't open. That's probably because it's locked. That might be. That might be right. Let's have a look. The door has an old-fashioned lock on it. It's an old-fashioned cylinder. Oh, it's lock. a cylinder lock. Uh, I don't really have anything to open it with. Maybe you could put a card in between the. No. Well, that was the door. What about the lock? Could you use a card in the lock? Yeah, apparently you can it's use a card trick, in the lock. But it still works. Let's go inside and see what it is. 
Uh, what, was, what else have we got? Oh, secateurs. Wire cutters, I guess, but they're used for, normally they're used for cutting. What does that say? Museum, sta I'm guessing station. That looks like an underground, like a the tube map, map to me. The map is on a big sheet of metal. Not the sort of map you'd fold and put in your pocket. Well, obviously not. It's an old map, but it means nothing to me. Okay, so we may as well leave. There's nothing else for us here. There's no way down there. Uh, that, to what used to be a subway station, I guess. So we're going to carry on this way. Oh, St. James. It's like a... Let's go talk to this guy. Excuse me. Hold it. Your uh, membership card, please. I don't have one. This then you is can't a come in. club. If your name's not oh, down. I didn't know that. You do now. Peace off. How do I join the club? How do I join the club? You have to be sponsored by an existing member. Sure. It's a most exclusive establishment. So I guess that rich lady Frequency should be there, yeah? Frequency only by those with the proper credentials. Sure. You mean people with money? No. Basically, people yeah. with credit. There's a world of difference. People with money think they can afford not to care. People with credit know they can't, but don't care anyway. Do not. What goes on, on in, the club? in the club? If I was to tell you that this club provides recreational facilities par excellence, that would tell me very much nothing. With elegance and taste, I'd be lying through my teeth. Okay. You just said it was exclusive. Well, it is exclusive, but seedy. Is that what the rich people, people like? Come here is the cheap booze. Cheap booze. And the fact that it's off limits to security. Is it uh, smart shoes? Smart shoes. It's got like Thanks. bright red shoes on. You can tell a lot from a man's shoes. Yeah, I can tell that you're weird. The design tells you what kind of man he is. The way he cares for them tells you where he's going. Is that, well, you're going nowhere, and what pal. what he's trodden in tells you where he's been. <laughs> Do you know anyone who would sponsor me? Do you know anyone who'd sponsor me? What about old widow Piermont? She used to come here, oh, years ago. If you chatted her up, she might sponsor you. That sounds dangerous. See you See later. later, buddy. Let's go see if we can get sponsored then. So she went that way. Just watched her go up. Oh, there's her dog. Which means she should be along any second. There she is. Excuse me. She is a bit weird looking, isn't she? Uh, would you sponsor, would you sponsor me, for me for the club? If you're really Robert Overman, I'll sponsor you. But I don't want to visit the club. I'll call the manager from my apartment. Mm, okay. Oh, well, better go this way then. Uh, what we want to do is go in this entrance here. Oh, come to mummies! I think. Doors are unremarkable. Je ne sais pas. I think it means je ne sais quoi, my friend. Uh, so there's nothing we can do there. Let's take a walk around because there were some other people we could talk to there. A gardener and a like a little boy. Oh, come to mum. We'll go this way. We need to speak to. Well, I think. Talk to the gardener first. I would assume he needs the secateurs, possibly. We'll, we'll see. Excuse me. Smart floral display. Are they real? What do you think? I they don't know. Kind of I know that that's not shiny. a knife. Naturally. It's not a knife. I've just varnished them. This is a knife. Do you paint the flowers too? This is Union City, not Wonderland. You obviously know nothing about plants. Well, 
Won't the varnish harm the plants? I can't I thought so. It filters out the crap in the atmosphere. Oh, does it? Some kind of what are you doing filtration to that varnish. I'm modeling a living sculpture. It's called topiary, and it's an art form. It is. A very interesting one sometimes. What are those blue flowers? Blue flowers. flowers. They're dandelions. Don't touch dandelions? them. Dandelions? They're pretty. Dandelions are weeds but why can't and they're they yellow. Touch them? Because if you do, you'll wet your bed. <laughs> oh yeah. It's one of those old wives' tales. See you, See you later. later. See what this little boy's got to say for himself. Hello. Who are you? My name's Vincent. What's yours? I'm Robert. You can call me Rob. Because he's going to nick your stuff. Uh, oh, wait. Why aren't you at, Why school, aren't you at school, Vincent? Do they have need for My school in a place like this? I tried to tutor has to malfunctioned. Video uh, would you like me to repair your tutor? Would you like me to repair your tutor? Oh, I can do that myself. Yeah. <laughs> but then I'd have to go back to my studies. Something tells me that he might have had something to do with it. What's that you're playing with? Yeah, what is it? It's my handheld games console. Woo. Neat. What's the game? It's called Fleecy the Lamb. That sounds nice. What's the objective? It's not going to be nice, is it? Mutant Psychos with your flamethrower. Yeah. And stop Dante Mantis from butchering the orphans. But that's horrible. Coming soon in 2019. Yeah, I'll play better. Maybe that'd be good. There is actually, I believe, well, what people believe to be a sequel to this coming out in 2019. Maybe it won't be. Maybe it'll be Fleecy the Lamb. Come on, guys. Fleecy the Lamb for 2019. That's what we want. What other what games have you got? you got? Not many, because they're too expensive. But, uh, preach. 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 I've got Nobby, the platform game. Onan the Barbarian. Onan the Barbarian. Does he like to... No. no. Dandelions? What colour are they? Yellow. Yellow, of course. Everyone knows that. The gardener told me they were blue. He's mad. <laughs> He's mad. <coughs> it's like uh, Monty Python. He's m mad, sir. Do you know a man called Overman? No, Rob. Why do you want to know? He's my dad. He's my dad. Aren't you a little old to have a dad? Last time I saw That's him, a strange I was a question. Boy. I was taken away to the gap. The gap? That is a, oh, a strange wow. question. I'd like to escape to the gap. I'm you, yeah, I've, I've heard they've got nice clothes do. there. By the gap. Uh, do you know the do woman you know with the, the dog? Woman with the dog? That's Mrs. Peebles, and she's a pig. That's not a very oh, nice. nice thing to say. Well, she tried to confiscate my console. Oh, so she could play it. She gave me a lecture and tried to force me to join the junior security call. Uh, don't wear out your thumbs. Don't wear out your thumbs. Yeah. You'll go blind. I mean, uh, no, hang on. That's not Excuse right. Excuse me. Okay, so there's a gardener here. The gardener told me he dandelions, told me were, dandelions blue, were blue. And he's a liar. Did I? Well... What of it? Or well, they're not. This boy assures me they're yellow. Ugh, smart ass little brat. All right, you got me sussed. Yeah. I haven't had any formal training. Okay. But I've always dreamed of being a gardener. Okay, fair enough. I love if that's it. been your dream. Every little shrub and succulent. As long as it doesn't break into Those I'm a lumberjack and I'm okay. They can. In the breeze. It would be allowed, but. All right, I get the point. I think that might have been what it was leading into. Why should I do that? Because he's not allowed. Okay, so let's just... I think she went in here. Hello! Who is this? It's your... your... your poops. Wait, that didn't even make sense. I'm sorry, that, that made no sense. It's me, Robert. It's me, Robert. Come right Oh wait, her name's Robert. not Robert. It's me, Robert. No. It's not you, Robert. I'm a bit scared about what's going to happen here. Well, she's wearing her clothes at Welcome least. Welcome to my humble little home, Robert. Oh, I know what I've got to do here. I know what I'm going to do here, because this will be good. You know, I remember you as a baby, Robert. I've grown a do bit you. since then. 
I'm sure you have. Oh yeah. You must have so many questions. Not really. Yes, I have. What was the professor, what was working, the professor on? working on? Didn't I tell you? Helmet was the design. Something of bad, him. I'm sure. Something bad. It was his dream. But he died before it was realized. Your father that is a shame. became the project leader. So my dad was responsible so for Link. He's responsible for Link? Yes. He stepped into Helmut's shoes. Link reached completion on the very day. Pardon? <laughs> he did what? From then on, <laughs> Richard changed. He spent more time. They brought him to completion. Than he did with his wife and baby. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Why did my mother, Why did mother try, to escape? try to escape? But she did her best to cope. But she wasn't the same after Richard's rejection. The authorities rejection. never approved of her marriage either. Well, the authorities because can go and take a fly and leap. Eventually, oh, no, she to return home. So the bastards had her killed. You're Pretty much. Brought, Robert. Would you like some... Paracetamol. Some paracetamol. I don't want analgesic. I want answers. Um. Oh well. Are you gonna sponsor, you gonna sponsor me, me now? Me now or what? No, that's what you want. Yes, please. I'll telephone the manager and make the arrangement. Great, you do that. It won't take a moment. Great. Wait. Whoa! I thought she was wearing full cl all her clothes, but she totally isn't. Is that Mr. Cool? I have a friend I wish to sponsor. Well, we might have seen a little bit more than we needed to there. Uh, what we're going to do is going to attract the dog. And it's a bit silly, but the only reason I'm doing this is because that dog has some biscuits. And I want them. All over my... Leave those biscuits anyway. Where are they? It's full of biscuits and dog drool. That's great. Give me some biscuits. If I pick up all over my. Yeah, great. Oh, there's the biscuits. That's what I want. Give me some biscuits. That's all I need. Just give me some biscuits. And we're gonna get out of here. Okay, well that's good enough for me. We didn't want to spend too much time in her house, because, you know, who knows where that might go. A little scary. Now, there are some other things we want to do before we try and go inside. a place we need to go here if I remember rightly. Oh, where is it? The big guy's sacks are... His, his sacks are spilling their contents. The less said about that, the better. Oh, yeah, that's what we want. Uh, what I need to do is put... So the dog biscuits, there's a reason we took the dog biscuits. We want to put them there. The reasons for which will become apparent later. And then we want to go into the club that we've just been sponsored to get into. So, we're going to talk to the doorman. There is a reason for that, and we'll come to it in a moment. Excuse me. Which is basically that we need to wait for Hello, Mr. Loverman. the dog. How did you know my name? To appear at You're some point. Member now, sir. I am. Thank you. It's my business to know all our members. Can so I whoever's in, in there, we want to go and talk to. You? Certainly, but you're in for a disappointment. How come? It looks smart with the lights well, turned low, but well, in that's daylight, like most clubs, isn't it? You know, they look great toilet. when the lights are off, and they look horrible and smell like urine. Never mind. When they're on. Which is great. Okay, so we've got a few people there. Let's talk to Gallagher. Apparently. Can we talk to him? Oh, never mind. He doesn't have much to say. Hi. Mind if I join you? 
Good afternoon to you, Mr. Overman. How does he know my name? What do you think of a clock? A bit crap, isn't it, really? The decor is really unpleasant. It's just a bit crap. I chose that myself. I'm Colston, the manager of the club. Oh, are you? Pleased to meet you. Kind of rubbish. Uh, your club's your club's kind of rubbish. What about the Excuse woman? me. She looks a bit more interesting. Hi. Mind if I join you? Careful. Well, hello yourself. They call me Bob. Pleased to meet you. But I. See you later. Oh, don't count on it. Don't count it. Why are you going somewhere else? Are you? Okay. Well, there's not much to do Excuse here, me. really, is there? What? Well, that was kind of a pointless waste of time. Can I have, Can a, I drink? have a drink, please? No chance. No. Why not? Why not? House rules. What? What house rule is that? You're you're allowed in here. You remember, you're not allowed to drink. No, there's no point being here then, really, is there? Oh, what's going on? What's going on here? Oh, look, the dog is there. That's what we need. And what we want to do is just grab this rope. And then just let it go. And the dog's going to have a little impromptu bath. It's the dog. Oh, she's got clothes on now. He's swimming. He's having a swim. Officer Blunt. And now, we can go into this cathedral that he wasn't guarding. Oh my goodness. Just for a second, you scared me. But you're only dummies. I can tell, because they all look the same. They must have switches to activate them. What Somewhere. do they do? Damned if I'm going to look for them, though. They kind of look like... Well, let's go in this door. What have we got? Some lockers. His skin is cold, like plastic. It's cold plastic skin. Reptilians, guys. His skin is cold. Yeah, same. This one? Oh no. Not her. Not Anita. She appears to have been exposed to radiation. They've they've like what have they done to her? They've put her in there. Another body, um, another body. So wait, so Anita's dead? She appears. To that one's just a head. I don't think it's. Well, okay, that's not much used to be. Uh. So wait, Anita was dead. She was alive last time we saw her. Let's go up and have a look. I know it feels like we're going back and forward quite a lot, but. Actually, it's something I want to do, so... Go up. So we need to go that way then there. So Anita has disappeared. I guess. I guess she won't be up there anymore then, yeah? find out. Lamb's still hanging around because uh, cause he can't go anywhere. He can't go home. Because he's been like delinked or whatever it's called. So now there should be nobody here then to stop me from investigating further the kind of area where the radiation is, right? I would have thought. So Anita's gone. So like, can we open these lockers? Nothing. Nothing. Oh, there we go. Got some overalls. Let's take them. He's wearing a jumper with a teddy bear on it. 
I guess that's the jumper the guy was talking about him having that he liked. Uh, okay. Let's take a look then. Some sort of reactor or something? Ooh. It's a it's a vault tech uh, vault, obviously. Uh, let's see how the reactor is first. It's uh, deuterium 15.85%, tritium 7.03%, temperature 2 million Kelvin slash 1000 Kelvin, plasma state 96% ionized, magnetic field 100 kilogauss, uh, Bremsstrahlung level 5%, danger exposure to zeta radiation. So what we're going to do is we're going to open the door, if we can, and then exit. The door's open. So let's go inside. What's this place? We've got the reactor core. Um, there's a oh, there's a card on the ground. Let's have that. That's what we want. I reckon. I don't think there's anything more we can do. We can look at the reactor core. The power in those things gives me the willies. Exactly. So we really don't want to spend any time in here if we can help it. We'll close the door just because I don't like the idea of that radiation getting out any more than it already is. Door shut. So we're not going to uh, come across any nuclear fallout situations just yet. Let's get our coat back. And we want to go back to the office where those police officers were. Uh, there's a reason for this, which is that we want to, um... See, now we've got two cards. We've got Anita's card, and we've got, uh... Reich's card, that's what I was going to say, Reich's card. Um... Go. So, yeah, now we need to go to a uh, security station. It's where those two police officers were that we tried to talk to earlier and who were totally hopeless. But we don't really need to talk to them. We just need to go in their little room and use the elevator to get back up to that room we were in before with the uh, link terminal. So let's go. You'd think they'd have realised this guy was dead by now, wouldn't you? But apparently not. So there we go. So now I need to use Anita's card with the link terminal. This is slightly different. So now we have something else. So what I want to do is use this on the eye. And then we want to go that way, if we can. Another eye here, we want to blind it. And we want to keep travelling east. That didn't blind, wait, 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 that didn't work. That didn't work. Hold on, I've gone the wrong way. I think I need to... Right, why didn't that work? That didn't appear to help me in any way whatsoever. I'm going to go this way. Oh, why there's a weird knight there. It's a bit odd, but okay. <coughs> I want to go this way. There's like a well there, but I'm not interested in that for now. Uh, 
God, she's not blind anymore. I need to blind the eye. I just got fried. But that blind thing doesn't seem to work. I need to use the card again, don't I? I'm supposed to be able to blind it and then that allows you to pick up the tuning fork. But that didn't work. Which is weird. Let's try this again. So what you do is so you click blind, you blind the eyeball. And then you exit. And then again, you use blind, you blind the eyeball. Go north. That doesn't work. Uh, and then we want to go north again. And then east. East, you know. Roughly. Oh, there we go. It's blind still. So now I can take the tuning fork. Just in time, by the look of things. Uh, so now what we want to do. is we've, we've got time now, so we use the playback thing there, the projector on the well. That'll make sense in roll, time. You see? This is basically all we're here for. Trouble is, the rendezvous is in a park on ground level. And now I'm a demon, I can't get there. Yeah, she can't. Well, to be honest, and now that she's dead, she can't get there. Oh yeah, there was the remains of the old subway, I saw that, but... Okay, well that's basically all we came here for, so we can disconnect from here. Ah, excuse me. And now we basically need to go back to where we came from. We need to go back down to ground level, essentially. Which means we need to go this way. Then go past these idiots. And then we'll go this way. And keep going down. I'm interested to see if she's got any mail in her link term in a link terminal actually. Just to see if there's any interesting storylines about Anita there. I think there's a link terminal on the ground floor. Pretty sure. Pretty sure we're not gonna take because I think we only had access for like 48 hours to this uh, level of access. A bit weird that they like store people inside lockers, isn't it? Just just a little odd, if you ask me. So from here we need to go this way. Yeah, so I want I'm interested. I'm gonna use Anita's card on this link terminal just so I can read. Whether she has any specific information, you know, personal details. All it says is her name is Anita Einbeck. She's a D-Link in Hostel 38F and balance of account is zero. Link status, zero. So yeah, she's a D-Link, so that's basically all it is. A gazetteer, uh, that's just all advertising stuff like it was. And that's the Union City News, so we don't need to do that because, yeah, it's basically the same as the other guy's one. Apart from the, the status. I should say that she was a D-Link. The other D-Link is now um, Lamb, who we made one. So we want to talk to Excuse me, Gardener again. Do you, you know, know Anita? Girl called Anita? Maybe I do. Maybe I don't. Why do you want to know? Well, listen up, Cobra. She's been murdered. 
I found her body in There's the cathedral. Spot. Can't see why you're telling me. I'm going to do a terrible Australian accent. It can't be any worse than yours. Listen, you douchebag. Excuse me. It's got lots to do with you. What's your name? It's Eduardo. Why? Eduardo is a nice Australian contact, name. Right? How come you know so much? Because she's dead. She left a message on her card. Listen, do you know what's happened to Link? I'm totally confused. Well, tell me what's happened to Link. Link is a living, self-replicating organism. Okay. Originally, it served as an advisor to the council. But it has gradually taken control. Alright, okay, I see. So there's now, like a council that's now why? under the command of a machine. Hobart's Skynet's taken over. A virus. It will check Link's growth. If we can get it into the system. Will you give me the virus? I can't. It's been downloaded to Link space. Anita was supposed to retrieve it. Since she had a Shreedman port. So have I. I owe it to Anita to get that virus. No chance. It's bound to be guarded. Is it? I can try at least. Where? Yeah, I've got Excuse to be able me. to do more than you. See, See you later, later, buddy. For all the help you are. Okay. So what we need to do is we need to go this way. Uh, to the door the other side of the club. The club, which just seemed totally useless. What was the point of... Oh, that's open now. Uh, what was the point of going there? To go in and have people say, oh yeah, here it is, and you can't get a drink. Silence in court. Ooh. Security Services, Department of Justice, Inc. Judge Chutney presiding. Court is now in session. Court's in session. Silence. I recognise that villain. An habitual criminal, if ever I saw one. Seems to me that... Uh... Ah, that's Mr. Greaves, my lord. The counsel for the prosecution. Mm. Silence when you speak to me. Well, I can... Now... That doesn't even make sense. Silence when you speak to me. Okay. Defendant, my lord. Not a contestant. It's not a game Union show. Security Services versus Howard Hobbins. Oh. Howard Hobbins. Hobbins. Come on up. Factory. Nice to see you, Howard. There he is, you look. look. Nervous, are you? Slightly. Really? The defendant is accused of gross contempt. Just get involved in a little court case and see what's going on. Intolerable. Yeah, but what? What have you got to say for yourself, eh? I've been framed, Your Honor. Hmm. May I elucidate, my lord? Go on, then. Doubtful. But hurry up about it. He's not gonna like Officer Blunt was investigating a complaint made against Hobbins. After questioning the defendant, he was the victim of an assault. Ooh. Ah, monstrous! Off with his head! Calm it down a little bit, really. Off with his head? It's a bit much. Defense? Is he entitled to any? Right, if you're interested in a fair I trial, yeah. So, my lord. Upon my soul, whatever next? I'll defend you. Who would be silly enough to defend this wretch? Yeah, I'll help you. Why not? For some reason, Very he can't well. speak now. Let's get on with round, round one. one. Fight! Fingers on the buzzers, everyone. Fingers on the buzzers. Officer Blunt. This guy's oh, mad. He was too busy guarding an empty cathedral. Record what happened. Oh, I was assaulted. And is the culprit present in You the were court? assaulted. Oh, that's him in the overalls. Is it? I rest my case, my lord. Or Good. is it? Where's my black cap? Well, wait a second. Uh, we haven't heard the defense. Yeah, just excuse Hello. me just a moment. Uh, is it really necessary? Yep, if you want to do oh, things go on. the correct just way it is. Now then, Officer Blunt. Now then, Officer Blunt. If that is your real name. 
What was the nature of your injuries? Yeah. I got very wet. You got wet. You didn't suffer any physical harm. I could have caught a nasty kill. But you didn't. Tell the court how you got wet. Yeah, how did you get wet, buddy? While patrolling on Bellevue, I think you went to help get a dog out of a pool, didn't you? By a sudden shower. Did you ascertain its source? That doesn't sound true. Oh, yeah. I heard laughter from the walkway hubbub. Laughter? So you saw him. So you saw the accused pour the liquid? Oh, I couldn't see anything. So you My didn't. Eyes so you don't know if it was him, you just. But I'd recognize his Making an assumption. Anywhere. How would you do that if you don't know him? Just how well do you know Harvey? Yeah, exactly. I've never met him before. And yet you say you recognized his laughter. Um, yeah. I don't know. Yeah, who lodged the complaint? The complaint against it wasn't him, was it? Objection, my lord. Defense is contriving to lead the witness. I don't think I am. It was a simple question. I wish to establish the seriousness of the complaint made against my client. Hmm. I shall permit the witness to answer. However, I'm awarding Mr. Greaves five points. Five points. Well We're not playing for, for so points. A well-timed interruption complain? that was completely worthless. Was and what was her grievance? What was Mrs. Pierman? She get wet too. Cruelty to her pet dog. Yeah, that was I me. <laughs> that was but me. He still hasn't confessed. Maybe that means he didn't do it. You know, just a thought. Four interrogations suggest harassment. Objection, my lord. Officer Blunt is not the subject of this trial. Quite correct. Objection sustained. Not, maybe he should be. Ten points to the prosecution. Do you know what? It doesn't really matter, does it? It's clear to me now. No that nothing I can do is right. actually going to help anybody. So. Hmm. Uh, uh, I wish to call Mrs. Yeah, let's Piermont. call Mrs. Piermont over. Call Mrs. Piermont. If she comes. Hello, darling. Oh my word! What's she wearing today? Yeah, just her weird clothes. Hello. What was your complaint against what Hobbins? What was your complaint against Hobbins? He was abused, my little dog. He was abused, your little dog? Disgraceful. I haven't had a dog abuse case since the infamous Spaniel, spaniel Mangle scandals. scandals. Was someone running a spaniel through a mangle? Did you witness Did the you attack? Did you witness the alleged attack? No. Not exactly. So not at all, then. Then how did you know about it? Did the dog tell you? Yeah. Officer Blunt reported the I said woof woof. How would you describe your pet dog? Objection, your honor. What's this is a trial, not a dog show. I'm just asking Objection a question. Objection overruled, Mr. Greaves. I want to get to the bottom of this doggy business. He's an absolute... Darling, darling. Is he? I don't think Everyone he is. But okay. adores him. I don't. Had you met Hobbins before, before this incident? I don't recall ever seeing him. But one takes little notice of mere maintenance. No, I suppose I suppose not. No further questions, Your Honor. Yeah. Let's get uh, Hobbins like to up there. The defendant. Did you assault Officer Blunt? Yeah. Objection, my lord. Why, men? What's wrong? Yeah, what's the what's the um, objection there? Repetition, my lord. Uh, it's the objection first question I've asked him. Are you guilty of assault, Howard? Not me. Repetition. I haven't even asked him the, the question pipes. once. And it burst. So Blunt soaking. He's repeated that question, but he's only ever asked objection. it one time. Hmm. Interesting. Why did the pipe Why burst? Did the pipe burst? Some joker had cut a power cable. Weird. They overloaded the steam release in the power station. 
Who did that? What kind of person would do that kind of thing? Oh, I see. Did you laugh? Did you laugh at Blunt's predicament? At Blunt. Laugh? <laughs> I'd nearly wet me pants. Careful. No further no questions. No further questions. Mr. Greaves, you may start the bonus round. The, the facts speak for themselves. Isn't a game show. Hobbins is a cruel bonus and round. callous Come man. On. With no respect for law and order. I recommend the maximum possible sentence. The it maximum possible sentence. I don't believe this is happening. No, this me is neither. Total madness. Yeah, exactly. You've all been warped in some way. Yep. And I think Link is the cause. Silence. I've heard quite enough of this nonsense. What nonsense? So it's time but you don't have a case. To make my judgment. Howard Hobbin. If we don't know where, what way your judgment's gonna go. Star prize. Star prize. Oh, he's actually got like a light show. Life imprisonment. Wait, what? However, in view of your service, to life the city, imprisonment. I mean, basically, I'm that's what you're getting in this in this whole city, isn't it? Two you can't go anywhere. Service. Well, that's a pretty fair. <laughs> that's a pretty fair change, though, Stop isn't it? Dismissed. Hey, you can go to prison for the rest of your life, or you can have two hours community service. What do you think? That's a difficult choice, isn't it? Okay. Um, I think we're going to make that where we finish for tonight, guys. Uh, thank you very much for tuning in. Uh, we'll be back with this... Well, let's say we'll be back tomorrow with more uh, Just Cause 4. And hopefully back to this on Tuesday. Uh, for now, thank you very much for tuning in. Uh, remember to keep an eye on my Twitter page and you'll, that'll kind of let you know when I'm going live because I'll always update that as I am. Although the thing to bear in mind is, generally speaking, I'm on about 10 o'clock p.m. UK time. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. In the US, that may, of course, vary. Or any other country, for that matter. Uh, but for now, thank you very much. And, uh, oh, also, uh, you can have a look at my YouTube page, which has got all my streams, all my previous streams uploaded in full, uh, unedited, in all their glory if that's the word you want to use. Um, so yeah, that's under Supernautis Streams, and obviously at Mixer we're Supernautis, and on Twitter it's Supernautis. Twitter.com slash Supernautis, but it's Supernautis Streams if you're searching for it that way, whichever you prefer. Uh, and drop me emails if you've got any suggestions of games I should play, or uh, any opinions, any ideas, any criticisms if you like. Uh, I'm always interested to hear what you guys have got to say. Uh, but for now, thank you very much, and I'll see you all next time. <laughs>